The APE, all-platform evacuation litter from Ferno Military Systems, is a quad-folding, rigid litter designed for your tactical evacuation needs. Whether your patient needs to be transported overland, by ground vehicle, aircraft, or watercraft, the APE will accomplish the mission. The APE litter utilizes 6061 T6 aluminum construction resulting in a weight of 19 pounds, 8.6 kilos, with a 350 pound, 159 kilo load rating. The litter meets U.S. military load test requirements and has passed NATO standardization agreement testing. The litter has an overall deployed length of 91 inches, 231 centimeters, and features folding handles to reduce overall length to 74 inches, 188 centimeters, for compatibility with the interior of ground vehicles and Black Hawk helicopters with the doors closed. The stored dimensions of the Ape litter are 14.5 inches, 36.8 centimeters high, 19 inches, 48.3 centimeters wide, and 6 inches, 15.2 centimeters deep. The all-platform evacuation litter features rapid deployment, folding handles and locking hinges, a removable replaceable litter bed, and is field repairable with common tools. It is a well-established fact that fast evacuation from the point of injury to definitive care has a direct positive impact on patient outcome. When personnel are injured, delays in transport because of equipment setup are unacceptable. The APE was specifically designed to be the fastest deploying quad folding litter available. The key to the APE's rapid deployment is the downward locking spreader bar that allows personnel to fully deploy the litter without confusing twisting of frame sections that can become problematic under stress. All four litter handles easily fold with the push of a button, reducing the length of the litter without compromising the rigidity of the litter frame. The six frame hinges independently lock on deployment as the litter is laid out on the ground. Unlocking of the hinges is accomplished with the push of a button for breakdown. A major factor in the low life cycle cost of the Ape litter is the removable and replaceable litter bed. No longer is it necessary to replace an entire litter due to a damaged or soiled patient bed. Because of the independent locking frame design, the litter bed can be removed and replaced by end users in a matter of minutes. A variety of litter beds are available to fulfill differing mission requirements. The litter handles, feet, and frame sections are field replaceable with a Phillips head screwdriver and opened end wrench allowing four deployed personnel to cannibalize damaged litters for parts to keep other units in service. Repair parts kits are available from the manufacturer allowing for user level repair. To deploy, A. Place the litter with the feet up and release the restraint buckles. B. Completely extend both sides of the litter frame with the feet and spreader bars facing up. C. Verify that all the hinges are locked. 10 places. D. Rotate both spreader bars up and step on the top centers to lock. E. Flip the litter over, secure and adjust the patient restraints as needed. To fold. A. Release the patient restraint buckles and flip the litter over with the feet up. Pull the restraints outward from the litter. B. Unlock and fold the handles, four places, toward the center of the litter. C. Unlock the spreader bar by placing full body weight on the top center while sliding the black knobs outward toward the litter feet. Both sets of knobs must be unlocked. Repeat for the other spreader bar. D. Fold the unlocked spreader bars down towards the ends of the litter. E. Push the sides of the litter frame together. F. Unlock the remaining hinges, six places, and fold the litter frame sections. G. 
Use the patient restraints to completely wrap and secure the litter. To release the lock spreader bar, you must place weight on the top center of the spreader bar to push it downward while simultaneously sliding both of the black buttons toward the outside frame of the litter. To release the patient restraint straps, pull the red loop up and toward the frame of the litter until there is slack in the strap, then grasp the two metal buckles and pull them apart. Turn the top buckle sideways and slide it through the slot in the bottom buckle. Place the restraints over the patient and slide the smaller buckle through the slot in the larger one. Ensure that the raised bump on the smaller buckle is facing up, and then pull the running end of the strap to tighten the restraint over the patient. Secure the loose strap under the patient or under the restraint. When stowing the restraints, roll the loose portion of strap and slip it inside the red release loop, securing it against becoming a snag hazard. Litter repair kits, litter beds, and patient restraints are available from the manufacturer. Inspection and cleaning. Inspect the litter after each use. Repair or replace any parts that are damaged. The litter bed and patient restraints do not require tools for replacement. The handles and frame sections require a number two Phillips head screwdriver and a 3 8 inch open end wrench. Additional inspection and cleaning instructions can be found on the information card that comes with each ape litter. A variety of equipment specific mounts are available from Ferno Military Systems allowing for securing of medical devices to the ape litter for transport with the patient. Also available from Ferno Military Systems are innovative folding litter stands that support the ape and all other NATO standardized litter systems. The stands are 33 inches, 84 centimeters, high when deployed and fold to a compact 17 inches by 5.5 inches, 43 centimeters by 14 centimeters. These compact litter stands are rated to hold 500 pounds, 227 kilos. Litter stand accessories include a removable mayo tray to hold instruments and supplies, as well as a removable and height adjustable IV pole. For more information on the Ape Litter or other Ferno Military Systems products, contact FMS at 735B Branch Drive, Alpharetta, Georgia 30004, country dialing code 1-770-521-1005, www.fernomilitarysystems.com.